Bike Ride Pro brings you the cutting edge in aviation innovation. Today, we dive into the 2026 Mikoyan MiG-41, Russia's next generation hypersonic interceptor. Let's explore what makes this aircraft so extraordinary, what challenges it faces, and why it matters for the skies of tomorrow. I, concept and purpose. The 2026 Mikoyan MiG-41 stands poised to redefine air defense. Envisioned as a successor to the MiG-31 Foxhound, it is conceived as a high-altitude hypersonic interceptor with an emphasis on space-capable operations. Its primary mission is to intercept and neutralize threats such as hypersonic cruise missiles, stealth aircraft, and possibly even low-orbit satellites. With an anticipated operational ceiling well above 30,000 meters and speeds exceeding Mach 5, the MiG-41 would significantly extend Russia's aerial reach, serving as a deterrent and a response platform to rapidly evolving aerospace threats, to design philosophy and airframe. Built on the legacy of Mikoyan's legendary interceptor lineage, the MiG-41's design philosophy emphasizes speed, altitude, long endurance, and advanced detection systems. Drawing architectural inspiration from the MiG-31, the MiG-41 is expected to incorporate a sleek, high-energy airframe, powerful twin-engine thrust vectoring, and variable geometry components to optimize aerodynamics at both high and mid-altitudes. Materials such as titanium alloys and composite structures would be used extensively to withstand the stresses of sustained hypersonic flight while minimizing weight and maximizing durability. Three, propulsion and performance. At its heart, the MiG-41 is projected to utilize advanced ramjet or scramjet engines, possibly in conjunction with traditional turbofans, to achieve and sustain hypersonic speeds. This dual-mode propulsion setup would allow the aircraft to accelerate rapidly to Mach 3 Plus, then transition to ramjet or scramjet propulsion for Mach 5 Plus crews. Coupled with aerodynamic efficiency and heat-tolerant materials, the MiG-41 could achieve exceptional range, potentially 3,000-4,000 kilometers, and carry mission-critical payloads over vast distances. Its ceiling and speed prowess might even permit near-space operations enabling engagement with exo-atmospheric threats. Sensors, avionics, and weapons. Cutting-edge sensors are integral. A multistatic phased array radar, infrared search and track, IRRST systems, and advanced data fusion suites could provide detection of stealth targets and hypersonic threats at extended ranges. The avionics would support networked warfare, linking with ground-based radar, satellites, and AWACS. In terms of armament, the MiG-41 could carry long-range hypersonic air-to-air -air missiles, kinetic energy interceptors, and possibly directed energy defensive systems. It might also deploy decoys or electronic countermeasures to neutralize incoming threats before weapons lock on. V. Strategic Significance Strategically, the MiG-41 represents a leap in aerospace deterrence. By combining hypersonic speed, high altitude, and advanced sensors, it closes the gap between traditional interceptors and missile-based defenses. This capability would complicate any adversary's planning, especially for low observable and hypersonic systems. Moreover, as great power competition extends into near space, Having a platform that can operate at the cusp of exo-atmospheric domains reinforces national sovereignty and airspace control. 6. Development Timeline and Challenges According to public projections, preliminary design began in the early 2020s, with a prototype expected by the mid-2020s and first flight in the late 2020s, potentially around 2026. However, achieving operational deployment hinges on overcoming formidable technical challenges. The development of reliable scramjet propulsion, thermal management for sustained hypersonic flight, and integration of advanced sensors under extreme conditions. Budgetary constraints, shifting military priorities, and international sanctions may further impact timelines. Additionally, ensuring pilot survivability in such harsh flight regimes may necessitate novel life support systems or even autonomous slash optionally piloted configurations. 7. Comparison with Roaring Rivals In comparison, the U.S. has explored concepts like the SR-72 Son of Blackbird, aiming for Mach 6 speeds, though details remain speculative.
China is also advancing hypersonic aircraft and drones. If the MiG-41 achieves deployment, it could outpace or at least match these rivals, offering a tangible hypersonic interceptor in service. It would mark a rare realization of a manned hypersonic combat jet in operational service, an astounding milestone in aerospace history. Seventh, implications for global air defense. The advent of a platform like the MiG-41 would force reevaluation of global air defense doctrines. Traditional fighters, missiles, and radar nets may become vulnerable or obsolete without adaptation. Nations may accelerate investments in directed energy defenses, space-based tracking systems, and faster interceptor missiles to counter the MiG-41's advantages. Arms control discussions might extend to hypersonic platforms to mitigate escalation risks, though verifying and regulating such highly classified systems would pose significant challenges. Now nine. Concluding thoughts. Ultimately, the 2026 Mikoyan MiG-41 symbolizes the next frontier of aerial warfare. A hypersonic near-space interceptor blending speed, altitude, and sensors to dominate the high skies. While still conceptual and challenged by technological and strategic hurdles, it represents a potential quantum leap in interceptor capability. Whether it enters service on time, or at all remains to be seen, but its mere possibility underscores how the nature of air defense is evolving at breakneck pace.